so much for you guys to catch up on it's been years and so much great stuff has happened married i have a child he's going to be one in about a week and i want to do videos on these individual things specifically rather than try to cram the whole update into one video so over over the course of a few videos i'll get you guys up to speed with what's happened in my life all the great stuff we'll start this vlogging journey again anyway this video is about something special you've seen the thumbnail you've, you've probably seen uh you know a car under a veil because that's how i'm gonna do it it's time for me to upgrade from the 720s that i've had for almost three years to something new those of you that you know watched my vlogs back in the day you would have seen i had a 570 gt and there's been a gap so you're like oh when did you get this i've had the 720s for three years it has been absolutely amazing one of the best cars i have ever driven no stop that scratch that it has been the best car i've ever driven there's nothing i've driven that has given me the same uh thrill and um emotion as that car you know um the performance the handling braking everything is just exceptional about that car so i got it stock and tuned it to 940 horsepower stage three tune did the exhaust billet inlet pipes obviously tuned the ecu another tech spring so it was lowered and it also had a, a, a wise tech like valve thing for the for the turbos just because i wanted it it has been the best car ever even my friend that drove it on the rally with me we did three thousand miles in it long tail rally day two and kev starting us off we're about to go let's go reliable car he loved it man and we we talk about that all the time so it's gonna be sad saying bye to it you know sad saying bye to it but i think it's time kept the 570 for three years I've kept this 720S for three years and yeah, I think it's a good time to say bye. Uh, hello to something new, something phenomenal. This has been my dream car for a very long time. Just sent the wire about an hour ago. Show me the money! I'm gonna pick it up. Super excited, man, super excited. Share this journey with you. And I'm also gonna be just sharing all the new stuff that's happened with me, man. I'm mad, mad excited about it. So I just finished training. Also in these vlogs, I'm gonna bring training to you guys and tips and diet, everything. I'm gonna try to bring it all, you know, but I'm back. That's the thing, I'm back. This is it, final day with the 720. I've already taken everything out of it. Now I just need to get a few things that I agreed the car would come with. So the original cats up there, I'm gonna put them in the trunk, see if they fit. I've got the original hood, the original wing as well. I'm not gonna take that today, they're gonna send a truck to come pick those bits up. But uh, I think everything's gonna go back on the car as it was. Oh, by the way, check this. Look at that. So I had such great news yesterday after going to the dealership and then came back to a nail in the Urus. Like, so disappointing. And that's gonna cost a lot of money because I cannot replace it. Normally, when you get a nail in a tire, as long as it's in the wall, sorry, as long as it's not in the wall and it's in this part here, you can have it repaired for flight and my guy does it free of charge. But when it's in the wall here, you have to get a whole new tire. And these tires cost a bomb, an absolute bomb. So I'm gonna be trying to sort that out. I've already ordered the tire. Should send that tomorrow. Great, great, but this traffic is uh, not the most exciting. I know, the anticipation is building up, huh? <laughs> yeah, How is it driving this for the last time? Well, I wish I wasn't in traffic, that's for one thing, you know? I know you haven't really been able to drive it properly. Let go, yeah. yeah. You know, traffic, traffic, but traffic. to be fair, babe, you've had plenty of opportunities over the last yes. few years. Yes. <laughs> to really drive I this definitely car. Have. <laughs> Yeah. Definitely have, man. But yeah, no, I'm very excited. Um, Good. It's, it's surreal, you know. Uh, it's 
dream car. So, yeah, just can't wait to get it. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous too. What are you nervous about? I don't know, to be honest with you. Are you, you going to drive it? No. What okay. I'm nervous about Wait, is wait, wait. You can't it skip seems, it's, it's, it, I don't know. I feel like I'm really used to this car. Like this McLaren. You're the passenger in it? Yes. Okay. Um, and I feel like, I don't know. Am I going to feel like I'm literally sitting on the road? Is it going to be uncomfortable? It's lower. It's lower. It's by the way, by the way, bigger. they don't know what car it is because uh, don't don't mention it. But yeah, it's lower. It's, it's a wider. <laughs> it's longer. <laughs> lower, wider, longer. <laughs> yep. You know. It's different. But yeah, you got to drive it, man. I'm gonna put you on the insurance and you got to drive it. Please don't. No, I'm definitely am. Let's, let's save our pennies. No, I'm definitely am. Yep. Uh, I'm not joking about that as well. You, you like. I put your insurance, and if I, you know, no, no. See, don't do that. Or... You always do yeah, that. 100%. Then we'll take my car. I'm not driving your car, and I Babe, mean that. You're gonna be driving. Okay, I'm off now. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>crazy gift ever <laughs> <laughs> yeah the lamborghini newport beach champagne sh saber kit <laughs> <laughs> that is amazing wow oh, oh my goodness look at these what is that oh wow. glasses look at that that's beautiful in our favorite matte black yeah <laughs> yeah oh, look at that oh this is beautiful to say bye bye McLaren and hello to the new baby so much room much more room I'm, than oh my gosh yeah I love it like I have so much space here we go 
Good morning. It is the uh, morning after the night before. You guys didn't see me pull in yesterday. I knew two cars could fit in there, but the SVJ is wide. So I wasn't sure if it was gonna fit. And uh, yesterday I had to move the Urus to one side. We do have another garage on the other side that's empty right now, but it's right next to Asher's bedroom. So we're not gonna park these cars in that garage because it's literally too loud. But yeah, I managed to squeeze the car in yesterday. There it is. garage needs a big clean out man this is embarrassing about how messy it is but I'm on it I'm on it now that we're gonna be putting two cars in it I've got to get rid of all these boxes I still got the Porsche charger from when I had the Porsche which I'll tell you guys about I had that very briefly so today I am heading to the tire shop to get this sorted there it is and because it's in the wall of the tire I've got to get a whole fresh tire. And these tires are expensive. $1,200. Ridiculous, man. Each, each tire, which is wild, you know. Um, luckily, with this car, I've got insurance for the tires. So I've got a special package that Lamborghini provide just for the tires and uh, for the windscreen and a few other things. But um, it means if I get a nail in the tire like this, it doesn't cost me $1,200. It is free. They will just fix it. And even if I mess up the uh, wheel somehow, uh, they'll fix that as well or replace it, which is awesome. All right, let's go. $1,200 lighter, but we do have a brand new tire. These guys always hook me up. So I'll give them a little shout. They are awesome. Great, the thing is like every time there's like a puncture, they normally do it just free. But when it's in the wall, there's nothing you can do. What's good, what's good? All right, so I've had my first drive. Earlier today, I went to the gym and I uh, had my first drive with it. And yeah, it's beautiful. It's just, it's, I don't know what more I can say. It's a fantastic car, man. It's going to take some getting used to. It's a lot bigger than uh, 720. It's wider, it's longer. You know, um, one thing that I had a little issue with kind of was uh, when I was getting my ticket for pulling underneath the barriers, opening the door, judging, you know, how far it comes out. It doesn't come out as much as the uh, 720, which is great. It goes more, it just goes more vertical straight up but I did I did misjudge it and I had to hold it while I grabbed the ticket so and then also how wide it is it's much wider than the 720 man so like I'm going so slow between those uh between the barriers like um eventually I'm going to know the width of the car and it just becomes a second uh, it becomes an extension of you that's how my 720 was just an extension of me I knew exactly how wide it was sometimes I'll be driving with Shannon she'll be like damn man like you're close and I'm like no nah, I know this car so I've got to learn this car and, and the width of it. But um, yeah, man, first drive was amazing. Amazing. I only had a quick session because I had to take Asha to uh, swim. Uh, we, we, we go swimming every weekend and uh, he's getting really good at that. Another thing I've got to share with you guys, you know. Um, but yeah, man, first drive done and it is amazing. So now I think today I'm gonna just like go through the settings, um, make, it, make it my own, you know, change a couple things. I still don't know Fahrenheit, even though I've been here for like seven years. So I'm gonna change it to Celsius for the units. Um, just make sure the whole setup is how I like it. You know, the seat's already all the way back, which is perfect for me. So I don't need to adjust that. Radar detector, I need to put that in there. I don't need a mobile phone holder because I've got CarPlay, it just plugs in. I just put my phone at the side. So yeah, man, just that's what I'm gonna be doing today, man. Just little bits and pieces, but here's the cars. Two balls in the stable now, two balls. I'm also gonna put an order in for the Revluto. I'll talk about that later, but I'm putting an order in for that because that car, Something special. Peace. <laughs> 